So hey guys and welcome back to Born Traveller. Right, today I'm going to do a video about uh, water filter bottles. Which one should you buy and which one is best for travelling? So which water bottle would be best for backpacking, travelling around the world? Well, I actually have gone for this one. Uh, Life Straw Go. It's the advanced one. They range from about $30 to $40 um, and they are pretty probably the best well-known brand around the world you do have soya as well but i think live straw are better than them for one specific reason which i'll get into later uh thanks for watching the video um please consider subscribing to the channel and if you've got any comments about this uh video leave them down in the description so firstly what is a water filter bottle well they've been out for a few years now and these got these things basically you can fill them up from any water source pretty much from a river, from a tap, from anywhere, and they will filter the water without any chemicals or anything. Uh, you don't need any electrics, you just fill it up and it just basically, you suck it through this straw at the top and it filters the water. It can essentially be very more muddy, dirty, mucky water, and it basically kills all the bacteria or traps all the bacteria. So what you're drinking is basically clean bottled water. Um, and obviously, as we know, the world is full of plastic. So this is a really good way to, to do two things, to save money and to save the goddamn planet. So why did I choose Life Straw over other brands? Uh, right, so the main reason I chose Life Straw is when I was traveling earlier this year, I was flicking between airports. I noticed that most of the airports had these in. And more importantly, they sold the filters. Now, if you're on a long term trip like me as a digital nomad i've been traveling i was traveling previously for two years continuously then the filters are going to run out after six months to a year depending on where you're traveling it's just going to not basically how it how it stops working is water just stops coming through it so that's how you know you need to replace the filter because you can't get any water through it they're about as much as the bottle actually they range about twenty dollars for a new filter but it's getting hold of them in third world countries but however i've seen them in india i've seen them in thailand these guys are all over the way, all over the place in the uh, in the airport. So, really good tip is if you see one and you know you're probably gonna, you know, it's gonna run out, then definitely buy one. So, what are the main features on this? Well, firstly, it gets rid of all bacteria, but more importantly as well, it gets rid of microplastics. This is the advanced version, so it actually has two filters, one at the top and one at the bottom. So microplastics, which we know are full in, the, full in the ocean. So when you're filling up, you know you're not going to be getting microplastics going to your body. I actually use this all the time. So this is great for camping as well as uh, traveling around the world. I used one of these similar ones. It wasn't the same one, but I used one similar from a different company. Uh, and I used it in Bangladesh. And I filled up from the tap in Bangladesh, which you can imagine is not the greatest idea if you didn't have one of these. So, and I was fine, didn't get ill. Uh, in fact, I didn't get ill at all in Bangladesh, uh, quite surprisingly. I had no stomach problems at all with any of the food. One of the other main features is it will filter 4,000 litres of water. So you're probably looking around a year's worth of water. As I say, it should last between six months and a year per filter. But it just depends on how much, basically, crap's in it. Because the, the more crap's in so if you fill it up from river all the time, it will deplete quicker. If you fill it up from a normal tap, say, in the UK or America, probably last year the full year because obviously the water is already pretty clean the other feature it has is this uh carabiner hook which if you've got a backpack like the osprey uh far point 40 and you've seen any reviews on it you'll know that the two front pockets when it's full you can't put a bottle in it or you're going to put a small bottle so you could hook this onto the side rather than trying to put it in uh into the into the, the um holder itself so another little handy feature so the straw itself actually kind of does come off so you can clean it so if it does get gunky you can clean it uh, which is nice i don't know about replacements i'm not actually looked into where you can actually get these replaced so probably best to be careful uh, you might not be able to replace it you can still use the bottle but obviously you're not going to be it's not going to be as comfortable when you when you're actually using it and the basically it just lifts up like that and you just suck and you have to basically make sure it's fully out and you have to just basically suck into it uh, and then it just folds away nicely and as you can see my only design flaw i think with this is it, there's no cover for the actual things so obviously any dirt when you're traveling especially like in places like india or africa where it's dusty it's going to get in 
Um, so you do have to kind of clean that quite a lot, but I think that's the only design flaw I've seen in this. But overall, a really, really uh, handy bit piece of kit, not a lot of money. And when you're on the road, if you think about in places like, you know, Europe, you might be spending one euro for every bottle of water. This really starts to make sense. Um, you know, you're going to save fortune, even in places like India. The maximum capacity on this is 650 milliliters, which I think is quite a lot, really, for, for a single use bottle. Um, and, and obviously you can fill this up any water source you find, you can fill it up. So even like a, a toilet, you know, uh, um, bathroom toilets in, in, say, China or India or wherever, um, you can just fill it up from the tap. You don't need to worry about it because it's going to filter it. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description where you can buy this from Amazon. Uh, please consider subscribing. Leave any comments you want. If you've got any questions about the bottle, just, just you know, just leave a comment. And I'll see you next time.